Hey everyone, Nittany Lion Roar here, and I'm back with another video to show you how to do some advanced hacking. Now, if you don't know how to do any hacking, make sure to go check out my other video because I explain that in detail. Uh, but this is for people who want to take it to the next level. Now, as you can see uh, in the game here, uh, we've got these sequences we want to try and do. And uh, of course, if I want the most loot, I need to go for this bottom one here. And I've already mapped it out. I can do BD, 1C, BD, BD. And there's actually multiple put, uh, ways to get that one. But once I put in four sequences in the buffer, I'm done. However, it is possible to put in even more and get more loot. And that's what you want to do, obviously. Uh, so how do I make the buffer bigger? That's really what I'm going to talk about today. How, how do you make the buffer bigger so that you can put in more codes and get more loot? Well, we have to take a visit to the Ripper dock. First, I'm going to go ahead and put this in, and then we're going to try and increase our buffer size so we can decode more of these hacks. Now I found myself a ripper dock so what we need to do is upgrade the operating system because the operating system is really what determines how big your buffer is so the better the quality of the operating system the better it's going to be and you can see we have a rare one here and what I currently have installed is two base RAM, four buffer size, two slots. And you can see um, my device hacks listed down below. But if I can upgrade it, I can get nine base RAM, six buffer size, and four slots. So instead of the four buffer, I can go with six. And that will let me decode more of those hacks so that I can get more loot. And I definitely think I want to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and buy that and go out and hack some more stuff. Okay, now I've run a little ways down the street and found another place to jack in, and uh, you can see that my buffer is bigger. So I have six slots here instead of the four, which means I can put the entire thing in if I can find the correct sequence for all of them. Now, I've already scouted this out a little bit, and the most efficient way for me to do this would be to do E9, 1C, 1C, 55. Because for each of their, these, there's a 1C in it, which means that if I do E9 with two one C's and then end it with a 55, I'm gonna hit all three codes at once. But there's one problem, because that's four characters, if you will. I need a fifth character, because up here, there is no way to start with E9. But it doesn't matter, because I can put extra characters in as long as I get the rest of the sequence in order. You can waste characters, that's okay, and you can still get all the loot. I'm gonna show you exactly how. So watch, I'm gonna do the BD first, and then I'm gonna do E9, 1C, 1C, 55, and I'm gonna get all three codes. Ready? And there it is. That is advanced hacking. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you know when I drop more videos and I will catch you in the next one.